Most people in America are familiar with what is and isn't life. In America, once you reach a certain age, you start really thinking about your life. A lot of parents fail their children not teaching them about the realities and the rules and the roles and responsibilities of life. I see that incredibly well across America and with children on college campuses that are not a part of a faith group at all. But I'm not saying that we have to have Catholics all across America. I'm just telling you my experiences thus far. They may be limited. They may be plethora. It doesn't matter to me. What I'm saying to you, though, is that my life is mine. And I had a plan for my life after I lost my spouse. It took a little while for me to figure that out. But usually when you go through a loss, there's an impact. There's an underperformance. There's a lack of productivity. And then there's a cho choice that one has to make of, is the economy right now supporting my business or do I need to make a change in what I'm doing what I found is that most people didn't know what to do with my background my experience or my business for their companies and what I also found is that recruiters didn't know what to do with me either despite the fact I had a sibling that was trying to align me with one you see the recruiter was recruiting to certain industries not mine and openly the recruiter didn't even know how to cross over to a new industry to help me meaning look for those companies or pass me over to someone in her official company who did that. And the truth is marketing jobs are literally a dime a dozen, but what gets marketed as marketing jobs aren't really marketing jobs. So maybe advertising is a better role for me, but that's not the point. When you're a personal brand specialist, you're helping that person to develop their actual brand for their profession, for their life, for their livelihood. And that takes time. And if you're not willing to invest a good thousand dollars in your life then you probably aren't planning your life and the reason I say that is because the most inexpensive of businesses you can buy for a sideline gig to your life is about a thousand dollar investment and there are plenty of good quality net mark work marketing organizations that will give you that business opportunity a business in a box but the reality is if you don't like the product if you don't like how it functions if you think it's too much time or too time consuming to even deal with the product and a customer might also feel that way then you're not likely going to get involved with it but if you're an athlete if you're someone who's concerned about health then there are plenty of products for you to choose from but not all of them have the peer reviews not all of them have the scientific methods behind them in the same value for the dollar that some do